Hi, my name is Kevin Good and welcome to my channel. On this particular playlist, we are learning beginning Hebrew. We've gone through, let's see, the alphabet. We've gone through grammar. And now we're working our way through Te'alim, which is Psalms. And we're doing Psalm 119. Today we are on bet still with Psalm 119.12. Let's dive on in. Okay, so we're going to start with Psalm 119.12 and bet. And remember, every eight verses is basically a consonant letter in the Hebrew alphabet. There are 22 consonant letters in the Hebrew alphabet. We've gone through Aleph, which was uh, 119, 1 through 8. And now we're in on Bet, which is 119, 9 through, and then we're going eight verses. Right now, we are on verse 12, okay? We're going to start with the Avrit, and then we're going to go over to the English. All right. Baruch Ata Adonai La Medni Hukiacha. Blessed are you, O Lord. Teach me your statutes. Okay, so let's break this down now. Baruch Ata Adonai. Baruch is blessed. Ata is you. Adonai is Lord or O Lord. Okay, so Baruch Ata Adonai. Blessed are you, O Lord. La Medni Hukiacha. La Medni is teach me. Ni is me, and then hukiacha, and the ha is you again. Once again, it's the ending. Hukiach is statutes. So, lamedni hukiacha, teach me your statutes. So, now we're going to come down here to the Shorish, and you're going to notice something a little bit different. Lamed, mim, dalid, lamed, mim, dalid. The only thing that's different is uh, the vowels underneath. But one means to study or learn, and the other one means to teach or instruct. Okay, but you'll notice that they're still in the same um, word family or group family, like the Shorish. It's in the same family, and that means to study or to learn or to teach. So it all means basically it's in the general area of the same thing. One of the things I've tried to avoid is, is digging down into the weeds of grammatical terms. But with verbs, you do have different types of verbs and verb groups. This one down here, lamad, is pa'al, and that's a verb group. And then this one is limed, is pi'al, which is a different verb group, but they're still a part of the same family. I know it gets complicated. Look, when I first learned English as a kid in elementary school, junior high, etc., I had no clue. I did not understand any of the grammatical terms. I was able to learn English by reading books and that helped me. And then when I really started to understand the different grammatical terms is when I started learning French. And then I'm like, oh, then everything started to open up. After that, learning Hebrew, it opened up a lot more. But um, reading is the best thing. And I've met plenty of people on the streets that don't have the grammatical knowledge, but they can speak Hebrew. And then you guys, if you're learning the reading, learning the alphabet and going through, it's gonna, you're gonna be good, you're gonna be good. And that's why we're going through Psalm 119. Anyway, that's my long whatever. I'm gonna read through it one more time and then we're gonna wrap this up. Okay, Baruch Ata Adonai la Medini Hukiacha. Blessed are you, O Lord, teach me your statutes. That's it. Thank you guys for joining me. If you like the content on this channel or this playlist, please hit the like button, subscribe, also the notification bell. So that way you'll know when I release new content. And um, also there are books, the links to books in the description. I am an Amazon affiliate. So um, if you buy a book from there, it helps me out and it doesn't cost you anything. Thanks again for joining me. I look forward to seeing you guys next time. Have a great day.